Hello, welcome. We're going to try and keep this as concise and quick as possible. You're likely here because you've been having some issues at the loading screen with your Diablo 4 beta. Those issues all come down to one character, and that is the Necromancer. And we'll show you how that issue happens. When you leave the game on a character, it doesn't happen unless you're on the Necromancer. So I'm going to go back to my desktop, and the game is going to then close out, which will take a second. And these issues are going to be much worse on older hardware, um, older GPUs, older CPUs, PCs with less RAM. Um, those things are going to make all of this time that it takes for these issues to resolve themselves naturally take exponentially longer. So right now we're going to load in to our Necromancer. And our Necromancer was the last character that we left the game on. So it will automatically be the first character that is selected and auto populates. And you're going to see that's going to cause a, a hang time issue where your game just freezes and you aren't able to move or click on anything. Like so. So here we are. This is an issue most people will sit and get very frustrated with. On my PC specifically, it takes about 40 seconds to resolve itself. On some people's PCs that I've talked to, it can take three to four minutes. So like I said, your hardware is really gonna depend on how bad this issue is. And it comes down to two things I figured out, either a driver issue or a queue issue. And I don't know why the queue would make a difference, but I tried to reproduce this many times and there were a couple times where the queue took longer than however it just did. Usually the queue is pretty instant. There's a couple times where the queue would be two to like maybe like a minute and a half longer than normal. So about twice as long, two times as long as normal. And then I wouldn't have this issue at all. The Necro would load in fine. And I'm not sure if it was having the issue in the queue or this is an issue with the server having to send more information. I really don't know, but it didn't happen every single time when the queue was longer than a minute. So we're going to load in and you saw the hang time issue. So we're, and there you go. That's, that's the main issue people have. There's another issue you can have too, where if you leave the game on another character and then come back and try to select your, your necro, you'll get a slight hang. And also I'm not editing any of this, I'm just one take Jake in this bad boy. So if I stumble, mumble, get over it. I'm trying to help you. <laughs> and so if you load in on any other character and you leave the game and you come back to try to pick your necro, you end up with an, uh, about a 20 second like pause where the game actually just kind of freezes completely where nothing is happening. So we'll leave on our rogue. And so when you load in, the rogue will be the first to populate. So you shouldn't have any hang issues when it comes to character selection. All your characters will be there on the left. But when you choose your necro, you're going to have a slight hitch. And then all the, these all resolve themselves over time. But some people don't want to wait an extra three or four minutes on top of a queue timer. And some people, depending on where they're at, etc., might have a long queue. So, like this is this is this would be a time where the necro wouldn't hang, which is weird because this only happened two or three times where that queue was a little bit longer than normal, where it wouldn't just pop into the game, and then I didn't have any issues with the necro, which was interesting. So now we load here, and it'll be interesting to see if we have the issue and we select the necro. Let's click on it and see. There we go. Good. It still happened. So now it hangs again, where the game can't click anything it's unclickable nothing happens you just have to wait it out and eventually your necro will populate now the simplest way to fix this issue as you can see right here is there you go it works now we're going back here now we're going to just exit the easiest way to fix this is to just load your game and instead of even worrying about picking your necro off rip you just want to go ahead and load the game in on whatever other character you want to play, like you aren't going to play like any other character really and then just leave the game and go back and pick your necro and the issue just resolves itself and i'll show you real quick and then we can be done see how that queue's shorter like that and the other one was a little so when this short queues really contribute to the issue with the necromancer i've noticed but let's go ahead and start but remember last time i went to go click the necro we got hang time I don't know what that play button does, but it's ominous. <sighs> Boom. Oh, I thought those were mine skeletons. I was tripping for a second. <laughs> I was like, what did I pick the necro? And now we'll go here and we have no issues. So that's the main workaround. Load in on another character. Don't leave to desktop on your necro. 
and you shouldn't have any hang time issues. So until they fix this issue with another driver update, I would either roll back your drivers or just do a little workaround where you log out on another character, load in, and then pick your necro. Awesome, glad I could help. See you.